There was a post here from the Magic Report on Instagram, Orlando's greatest free agent signings. And they're giving us five options, Peach. Richard Lewis, Hito Turkoglu, T-Mac, the general, Horace Grant, and Bo Outlaw. So of mm. those five, Peach, who is your greatest Orlando Magic free agent signing? Uh, well, I'm surprised Joe Ingles didn't make the list. Um, history will not be kind to that post. Um, <laughs> but uh, I also learned that Horace Grant was called the general. I've never heard him <laughs> called that before, but okay, I guess. Um, yeah, I think it might have to be Horace Grant for me. I've mentioned it a couple times before on the show that I thought that that was the that was the signing that kind of put us over the hump, right? We had Shaq. We had Penny. We needed a veteran leader to come in. It was, it was Grant and you know, he was the general. He led us to that. He didn't save us any money on our car insurance, but, um, yeah, he kind of became our de facto leader and, uh, that's what you kind of need. I mean, it's hard to, it's hard to ignore those other guys cause they were all also very great. And like in the case of T-Mac, the face of the franchise for a while. But, um, for me, I think it's Horace Grant just cause of the timing and where he fit. But you know, Richard Lewis was great. Richard and, and Haiti are two of my favorite players. So it's tough to pass on them. Where, where are you at? Uh, yeah, I was just looking in spot track for some of these signings um, and just some of the See details. Was, any, was there anybody they left off this list? I feel like Bo Outlaw was, was just like sort of, ah, yeah, put him on there. It's like, come on. <laughs> well, they they have – there's there's some type of error here. I think uh, 2007 to 2012 was when he was with us. They have it listed as the Washington Wizards. But Richard Lewis, I don't remember him ever playing for – the Washington Wizards. I got the yeah, right. He played for the Wizards after us. Oh, okay, so maybe it was that same contract though. So um, we must have signed him in 2007. It was a six-year, 118 million average salary of 19 million. I'm gonna go with Hito Turkoglu, just because it was a steal. Looking at this deal, six years, 36 million dollars. It was a mini. Um, it was signed using the mini mid-level exception, which I'm going to learn more about in Sports Business Classroom and be able to explain exactly what that is uh, more eloquently when I get back in a week. But that was an average salary of $6 million a year. So, I mean, for me as a free agent to get that guy who became – I mean, he was the – if we're talking about the general, and I've also never heard that uh, nickname for Horace Grant. Excuse my ignorance if it's if it's a legitimate thing. Let me know if I'm a casual in the comments. But talking about a general, Hito Turkoglu was the general for that squad. I know we had Jameer Nelson, and he, he was the point guard running the show. But, man, when we needed a bucket, we wanted the ball in Hito's hands. He would take the ball at the top of the key and make the pass or take the shot to win the game. And to have a player like that on that type of contract, getting him as a free – he was a free agent. He was out there. A lot of people could have gotten him, and nobody did. And he became an integral part of our championship runs and our Eastern Conference Finals victories uh, and our and appearances. That is that is big. That was a great signing, and I think that would take the cake for me. But let All us right. know. What, what do you think, ladies and gentlemen? Are there people that were left off of uh, Magic Report's – list are there um ones that you you think are better than what we came up with yeah you can make an argument there for well four of the guys and be fine with me i wouldn't argue but if you said yeah. bo Allah, i'd be like no 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 <laughs> <laughs> i mean bo is integral to the community now he's the you know he's what is, he has the uh, sure. position of the community outreach coordinator and he hops on mm -hmm. some of the broadcasts sometimes and he definitely bleeds blue but that's uh, the best free agent signing i don't know about that Thank you.